Cold start time. So I don't really know how to start this since this is my first video. Today we're doing an oil change on the car. I think my last oil change was at 49,000 miles and we're at 5,400, 500 miles. 5,400, 500 miles. I think it's time for an oil change because uh, I've been abusing the car a little bit. So I'm just gonna change it, not take any chances, you know. So I'm just gonna run down right now to AutoZone, get some oil for the car. I have a fat exhaust leak on my car. All right, the X pipe, I don't know what the happened to it. I welded that shit at least four times and it keeps breaking on me. So I'm just gonna get a brand new one. I'm just gonna warn you guys right now. This video is probably gonna be all over the plate. And uh, yeah, man, let's uh, get to AutoZone. Let's buy this oil and let's do this oil change. All right, so let me tell you guys a little bit about the car. This is a 2016 V6 Mustang. It's a full bolt on, it's E85 tune. It's pushing three, about 320 horsepower to the rear wheels. Um, I know these cars stock make 300 cranks, so to do 320 to the rear wheels on a V6 Mustang, it's not, it's not that bad. It's pretty good. The only problem is the E85 station is, is like 40 minutes round trip. A lot of you guys may may uh, may think that's far, in my opinion. I think it's worth it. Like to me, to have that little bit of extra horsepower, you know, it just, I don't know. I just like having that number there. To me, it's just... I gotta have it. And if I go back to my other tune, I'm just gonna feel like it's gonna be a little bit slow, so. I mean, I'm, I'm already slow. Like, the, this thing is not fast at all. I mean, I did gap a, a 5.0 once. On the zero to 60, on the top end. <laughs> Let's not talk about that. A lot of you guys may ask why a V6 Mustang. If I would've gotten a 5.0, I think I would've been dead by now. The dumb shit I've done in this car, it would've either been totaled by now or I would've probably been dead. So, I'm glad I got a V6 Mustang for my first car. It got me into the platform of sporty cars i like jdm and stuff so to get this car it's a little bit of both because it's the v6 engine but then you got the american like shell you know but i'm glad as a first car i didn't get a 5.0 because that would have been a whole different story definitely one day i'm gonna have to get that mustang v8 damn honking honking damn oh that was ugly as we have made it to AutoZone. Oh, 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 I just scraped. Oh my. Is this closed? They can't be closed at this time. Are they closed? Oh, it's 1032. I think they're open, right? Let's get that oil, baby. All right, so we have acquired the oil and the oil filter. K&N and Royal Purple, you know, best of the best. No more tires left. No more. They're gone. Beep. About to change it. We got the we got the jack stands. We got the oil. All we need to do now is find somebody with a jack. My jack is broken. Lift up the car. And the jack falls. So I'm not trying to die under this car, you know. Yeah, this falls on me. I'm dead. So uh, we got to find somebody now with a jack so we can put these under and do the oil change. All right, so day two of trying to do an oil change. Um, so it turns out yesterday it started raining, so I couldn't do it. And uh, my jack is broken. So I'm going to Harbor Freight right now to buy a low profile jack because the one I had before was not low profile. So I had to put the car up on wood blocks, raise it up. So I'm just gonna pull the trigger and buy a new one, make life a little bit easier. Uh, but without any further ado, let's hear a cold start. That exhaust thing is, is disgusting. I don't know if you can hear that. Make sure there's nobody coming so we don't kill nobody or crash the car. Oh, and I need new brakes too. Yo, everything's messed up in this car already. 
everything's due for a change in this car. Shit, waking up the neighborhood today, huh? Old lady was looking at me, about to kill me, looks like. We are almost there to Harbor Freight. Hopefully they have those jacks in store because I saw that on the online they were uh, sold out, so. So I'm hoping that they do have them in the store. I need this jack today. Oh my God, it's packed at 10 in the morning? For what? So now we got the jack, we got the jack stands. We should be all ready to go. This time, hopefully it doesn't rain. Hopefully we're all good. Cool, cool riz, my guy. Beautiful. Your boy did it. I think, I think like a tad bit fell on your driver. Oh, that's fine. Not as bad as last time. Last time there was a whole puddle of oil on my driveway. All right, so the oil filter is right there. You just gotta drop the car and then we're chilling. Oh, I'm, myself, look, look, I'm, I'm sweating, look at this. Now that the oil plug is in, we're chilling. Now we gotta take out and replace the oil filter. Yo, Ford, stop making shitty cars. Tad bit, tad bit. Oh, shit. You good? Yeah, there's oil inside the filter. No, no, I know, but hopefully most of it's gone. You guys have a v6 mustang you understand it's right it's right there it's it's right there yeah you see chevy doesn't do this chevy's way better i'll get one of those or one of the corvettes i have in my house you know just 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 get a corvette or a camaro i promise it won't happen all right keep going So your Corvette don't run right now, huh? Yo, okay. I'm just talking about how great this 3.7 V6 engine is. Amazing. This fucking garbage. For an oil change, you know how much oh, I dropped yeah. on this oil change? $350. The jack, the jack stand, and all this oil, and a filter. Bougie shit. Try to be like Big Daddy and no, that shit did not work at all. Brute force. Ho! Oh. You got it? Ho! Oh. Bro, that shit literally gets on a bunch of wires and stuff. Like, oh. hey, look at all that oil. Look at it. It's on the driveway. God damn it. It's like everywhere, bro. Yo, Ford did not think about this. Shit. Mm. That, oh, oh, nice. Now nice. Oh my God. <laughs> Ford. Oil change what? Oil change number Ford. 10 and we still, can't, we still can't make it clean? Ford. It's like a whole fat puddle. Oh, yeah. Why are you putting gloves on? You got the gloves now. So, so now you just... Special mechanic. You better give a prostate exam to the yellow. Yeah, I don't know why in God's name they would fucking... All right, so now we're putting the oil filter on, it screwing it into place. At least this one has a... Uh... That's what you got by me. Who runs a 9 0 at the 8? You. Oh, you. No, I run an A3. I have, I have, I have this time strip. I run an A3. No, you don't. This it's it's supercharged. Let's start with the low one. You gotta give it some love. So you like the little one? You didn't know that, did you? Huh? Of course I knew that. Why do you think I got the the, the big funnel? Slow. All right, guys, and that is how you do a successful oil change on a uh, 2016 V6 Mustang. Done by the best right here, Robalo Engineering. No wildlife was harmed during the making of this video. He has a four cylinder Corvette. My bad. It's a C5 and a half. No, there's a fat nail on the floor. Go. More back. Oh. More. Onto the sidewalk. Oh, I stepped in it. You're good. Stop it. Good. Yeah. Driveway destruction. Oh. Put towels over it. And a piece of turd. It's rat turd or something. I don't know. I don't know. It's some type of turd. You guys, don't do oil changes or anything to your car and slides. Wear shoes. Florida's a lovely state, except for the heat and the rain. But when it's cold, no one likes it. I definitely don't. 70, 70 degrees. Yeah, 70 degrees is fire. Not okay. Anything below 70 is just garbage. All right, guys. Three likes on this video. Three, three likes. Three. Whoa. Yo, yo. We gotta start off small, my guy. Dude, three likes. That's like our friends. Three likes on this video. And uh, 10, 10. All right, <laughs> 10 likes on this video, and we're gonna start working on uh, Sergio's Corvette. I don't know, it just looks nice. The car looks nice. Yeah, I know, my car's sick, right? 
Dude, this is like the 30th time you almost fallen. It's hot. All right, now that the oil change is complete and the, the new filter is in, it's time to uh, start the car and see, uh, and I don't have the keys. Um. Oh. That was, that exhaust leak is dis disgusting. I think that's just old oil. Make sure I don't see any leaks down there where the oil filter is at. Because that would not be a good thing. I think we are okay. All right, you can close that hood, we're done. All right guys, I'm gonna have a GoFundMe page down below. Donate to this one in the back. He needs a uh, car parts for the Corvette. He needs some uh, Texas Speed headers. He'll take anything. What's up guys, uh, you made it to the end of the video. Like, subscribe. Share it to your friends. You know, turn the notifications on. Let me know if you guys want to see anything in particular. Um, I'll record whatever it is. It's so hot. It's too hot. That's why I'm in the pool right now. Take care. Have fun. Stay safe. Smoke is out.